When Israel was in Egypt's land, let my people go. When Israel was in Egypt's land, let my people go. Oppressed so hard they could not stand. Thank you for all coming here this evening to share this fine Passover Seder with me. It is an honor to open my home to all of you. I know that for many of you it's your first Seder, but don't worry. The tradition of the Seder is to explain all the symbols and rituals as we go along. Just follow along in your Haggadot, the Seder books. As you can hear, my voice is a little sore this evening, so thankfully my great friend Kesat has joined us to lead the service. You go, Kesat. Thank you, Mutton Chop. And thank you, Rabbi Sackman. We'll begin the Kiddush, the prayer over wine. All right, wine, 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 spodioti. And I didn't even need to bring a fake ID. It's grape juice for the kids, Ratso. But it's the same prayer. Now we drink the cup of wine leaning on the left side. Check it out. I'm digging a seam with a gangster lean. The next thing we do is each take a piece of parsley. Don't eat it yet. And dip it into the salt water. The vegetable reminds us that our ancestors were tillers of the soil, grateful for its bounty. And the salt water represents the tears of our ancestors shed when they were slaves. As our door is open, may not only the hungry come, but the spirit of the prophet Elijah, that we may tonight think wisely and feel deeply as we set aside this cup of wine. So who's this Elijah character? And how come he gets wine and I don't? Well, you don't get wine because you're too young. And we leave this cup out for Elijah because he's a great prophet who helps us in times of trouble. He deserves to be welcomed into our celebration. And if you watch closely, maybe he'll drink some of that wine tonight. Well, why don't I just mark the glass and see if he comes by or not? That's not very faithful of you. You were probably a contrary son as a child. Elijah is as real as you and me. I'm sorry. How about I make it up to you by singing my favorite Seder song? The song about the four questions. Please do. Halayla <laughs> 
הלילה הזה, הלילה הזה, כולו מצב. Now let's recite the question in English. Is that Elijah? Maybe. It's open. Come in. How y'all doing? It's Mr. Eisen from next door. Yay! I thought I'd come by and ask you if I could buy some matzo and orange juice. Sorry, no OJ. But we've plenty matzo. Take, enjoy. Thank you, Papa Town. I love you. Good night. As I was saying, Here's the four questions. Instead of the youngest child reading them, since we're all young at heart, let's go around the table reading. Why is this night different from all other nights? On all other nights, we eat either leavened bread or unleavened bread. Unleavened bread is the matzah, right? On this night, why only matzah? On all other nights, we eat any herbs. Why on this night, only bitter herbs? On all other night, we do not dip our herbs. Even once. On this night, why do we dip them twice? Dip, 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 dippity dip. What makes this world go wrong? That's not one of the questions. Sylvester can't read. Don't feel bad, Sylvester. I feel bad. Good for you. And Spice can't talk, but I'll do this next part. On all other nights, we eat our meals in any manner. On this night, why do we sit around the table together in a reclining position? Here are the answers to the questions. Why don't you start, Serge? 